Hello everyone, happy to see you here and today we have a really interesting challenge 3 to the power x equal to x and we need to find our x. So let's do this right now. First of all, let's apply nature lock on both sides. So let's do this. So on the left side we like take nature lock. So what do we have right here? Nature lock of uh, 3 to the power x and we have the same thing with the right side. So we need to apply this nature lock on the right side. Right now we need to know a really great log property, I hope everyone know about it, this is a classic log property, when we have natural log of a to the power b, and doesn't matter like nature log, log generally, yeah, so if we have this expression, so then b will come down right here, so as a result we have b times natural log, natural log a, and right now let's apply this rule right here on the left side, so x will come down right here, and as a result we have x times natural log 3, equal to nature log x. Okay, this is our expression right now. Right now let's group our constant on the left side, for example, and our variables on the right side. So let's do this right now. And for this let's divide both sides by x. Okay, when we divide both sides by x, as a result on the left side we have our denominator like that, on the right side we have our denominator like that. Okay, and as a result this x cancel with this one, so we have nature log 3 equal to this expression. So nature log 3 equal to nature log x all over all over x okay brilliant but right now um, a lot of students prefer variables on the uh, on the left side so let's change position it changed nothing for us but it helps us a lot like for understanding this challenge so we have nature log x all over x equal to nature log nature log 3 okay here is our challenge right now a lot of students need to know about lambert w function a lot of students need to understand about this function because this function will help us a lot so i want to explain you this function for example right here on the left side on the right side so let's do this real quick this is really great function i hope you will understand it with my explanation so for example imagine we have expression like that a times e to the power a okay something like that a is wherever you want expression wherever you have for example in this challenge like we will find this expression but we have a right here a right here, this should be like the same expression, and when we apply lambda w function from this expression, we will have only only a. And right now, let's try to create this expression on the on this left side. Let's do this. So we need to have e, okay? We need e, really need e. So right now, instead of x, let's write e to the power nature log x. It changed nothing for us, it changed nothing, but it helps us a lot in the same way. Okay, so let's do this. So right here, what do we have? Nature log x over all over e to the power nature log x okay it changed nothing because this is absolutely the same the same x as right here but it helps us a lot right now we have e so nature equal to nature log 3 okay right now if you look closely we have e this is really great so we have the first element uh, to our lambert w function but right now we don't have like a denominator right here so let's bring this expression from our denominator to our numerator let's do this so what do we have right here we have nature log x times e to the power minus natural log x, okay, because we bring in this from our denominator to numerator, so minus natural log x equal to nature log 3. And right now, looks like we have a great expression, we have natural log x, but we have minus natural log x right here, so it's not a and a, this is a and minus a, but according to Lambert W function, according to the definition, we need to have like a and a, so absolutely the same expression. So for this, let's multiply both sides by minus 1, and then we will have like a really great thing, let's do this. So we are multiplying both sides by minus 1, and as a result, we have minus nature log x, okay, so minus nature log x, times e to the power minus nature log x, and equal to minus nature log nature log 3. Okay, really great. Right now, if you look closely, minus nature log x, for example, this is our a, keep in your mind that this is a, and we have the same expression, the same expression right here, this is also our a, so as a result, we have a really great case. This is our Lambert W function case, so we can easily apply this Lambert W function in our case. So, this, this, this rule. Okay, let's do this. So, we have Lambert W function of minus nature log x times e to the power minus nature log x, okay? And equal to minus, uh, not like minus, lambda w function right here, don't forget about this, minus nature log, nature log 3, so we apply both on both sides, don't forget about this, this is like a really huge mistake when you apply this only on the left side. Uh, okay, right here, let's look closely, lambda w function of this expression equal to a, in our case a is minus nature log x, so after all things right here, we have on the left side, we have minus nature log x equal to 
lambert w function of minus natural log natural log 3 okay really great and the really important moment right now this is a constant so it's it's really great also because this is a constant and from here we need to find only our x so let's do this so there are a lot of tricks right here a lot, a lot of uh, really great um, tricks according to natural log according to log generally because right now we need to know about log rules log property this is enough about lambda w function so right now we don't need this lambda w function we need to uh, simplify this expression so first of all let's multiply both side by minus one okay when we multiply both side by minus one we have only like natural log right here so by minus one we're going to multiply as a result we have nature log x equal to minus lambert w function of minus nature log nature log 3 okay right now we need to know a really great trick when we create base of e on both sides so let's write for example this is a power and we write this e on both sides on this side and on this side let's do this so we have e to the power nature log x okay equal to e to the power minus lambert w function of minus nature log nature log 3 okay really great right now let's look at this uh, expression on the left side e to the power nature log x this is only our x yeah only our x without anything yeah so right here we have only our <coughs> x on the left side and on the right side we have this expression e to the power minus lambert w function of minus nature log nature log 3 Right now, let's look closely right here. We have minus, so let's bring this from our numerator to our denominator. So what do we have right here? x equal to 1 over e to the power lambert w function of minus nature log, nature log 3. Okay, and this is our, our solution. But a lot of students confused because uh, they look like plugging this expression. So lambert w function minus nature log 3, they uh, plug in this expression in their uh, mess libraries or, li or like a calculator and um, here's my explanation to this part because when they plug in there is no like real number root so in terms of real numbers this expression does not exist so lambert w function let's write it right here so lambert w function in this point minus nature log 3 does not exist let's write all of the things right here does not exist exist okay so it implies that in terms of real numbers in terms of real numbers Mm, there is no way like we will have like this expression in terms of real numbers because this is a complex complex unit so also this is a complex solution okay this is a complex complex root but this is a root generally this is a root so we find this root this is a complex root and maybe for those who are interested in the plot i'm going to show this plot right here so look just look at it so we have look looks like uh, we have um, two lines right here so exponential function two to the x and our linear function uh, y equal to x so as a result we have, we have like no point of intersection so it's just a proof to this challenge that we don't have like real number roots this is looks like a proof to this challenge here yeah, we don't have like real number roots we don't have like a point of intersection right here you can easily you can do this right here on this on this plot we don't have like a point of intersection and we have only one maybe in infinity in terms of infinity in terms of like um, minus infinity i don't know exactly but we have complex root and this is our this is our answer to this challenge so i hope you i hope you understand this explanation i hope you learn something new and we can easily see mm, this moment right here because mm, this lambert w function in this moment in this point uh, does not does not exist okay so right here we don't have like a real number root we have only complex uh, we have only complex root so this is a very great challenge to practice uh, for everyone because uh, this challenge uh, what include this challenge this challenge include uh, logs uh, rules right here we have logs rules log, log property we have lambert lambert w function uh, w function we have right here uh, really great properties according to e yeah right here a lot of properties a lot of a lot of properties right here so this is a really great uh, question for to practice in uh, everyone it includes a lot of um, a lot of parts of mass log rules right here lambert w function properties e right here so complex numbers so this is really great challenge to practice for everyone so thank you for your time have a great day also don't feel bad if you got this wrong if you need help with any of these classes i have a lot of videos on my youtube channel i have a lot of questions a lot of really interesting content so i hope you will enjoy it you can also support this video with your like with your comment i really appreciate it it helps me a lot it inspires me a lot to make a new content every day and thank you for your time, have a great day, see you in the next videos, take care and have a great day.